fun fact that hangs are great for back problems. If you have like a weird lower back issue, just like hang from a bar for like 30 seconds. Help to decompress the spine a little bit. Also stretch your back out. It's great. Welcome back. Uh, we are currently hitting, well, welcome back. We're hitting back today, I guess. <laughs> yeah, get a nice little, nice little pull day in. See how strong we're still feeling. Um, I was sick like, like a few weeks ago. So, like everything kind of like tapered off for a little bit because it's like, it was nasty. Um, but we're getting strength back. We're still feeling good. We got a cut from carbs this past weekend. Got another push in terms of like some other things that are going on. Uh, protocol went up, so we're happy about that, but we're feeling good, so. Back on back. Let's go. Uh, plus it's packed as fuck in here, so let's see what we can do there. We'll see what we can do without getting in anybody's way. With every exercise, regardless of what I'm doing, I'm trying to get more in the habit of whether it's warm up, top set, back off set, whatever, I'm trying to make it to where whatever last rep I'm hitting looks the same or at least like ends the same as if I'm going for another rep. Sometimes I'm bad about it and I'll just like drop the weight and I need to not do that because that's how equipment gets broken, so it's fun. Right now we're going to dumbbell rows, close grip, not going like super wide. It's gonna target the lats, obviously. But, I don't know, I've really enjoyed this lift. I used to absolutely hate it, but that's also because I was small and not strong. Now I'm still small, but I'm strong. Um, so, we're gonna work up to two sets. Uh, work up to an eight to 10, probably with my heaviest set. Then we'll do a back off set. The back off set will be like a 12 to 15 see where we hit within there each time is mostly just kind of shooting for failure but if we hit the goal rep range try and keep pushing a little bit um, and within isolated movement like this obviously you kind of want to start with your weaker side and move on to your stronger side um, for me that's gonna be my left side so I'll be starting all these movements off of my left and then try to match it on my right so yeah Get all the little kids to say uppies. Get their get their parents to pick them up. <laughs> Me when I say uppies, it means I'm going up and wait. Uppies. And uppies. regardless, I will be picking these up. So uppies. Uppies. Pull day is actually just uppie day. I'm tired. And we're only one thing in. Got a small toddler. But actually. Probably a small teenager. Yeah. That's me rolling a small teenager. He's like a like a fifth grader right here, fifth grade, sixth grader. There we go. Ah. Like the shoes today. Thank you. Very satisfied with these. I haven't bought any new shoes in a while.
So with these, it's gonna be a similar approach kind of with the dumbbell rows. But when we do end up doing the back offset here, there's gonna be some tempo work involved. So the tempo work, I'm gonna be trying to work on, focus on lighter weight. So we'll probably try and work our way up to four plates if we're feeling it, three and a quarter maybe. Um, but after we get that top set there, work my way back down to two plates for my back offset. Focusing on big ups, real quick, one count up, one count pause, trying to think on like three count down. I'm trying not to go fast, but not trying to be like one, 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 two, three. I'm trying to be one, 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 two, three. Tempo work. It's their personal gym. So they, they almost got there. They own this place. They are Brent Laff overhand. So, rush into this a little bit, skipping initial warm up set. Feel the weight relatively warmed up with all of our back stuff, but Tyler can't stick around too much longer. So, uh, jumping into it, which is fine. Yeah, uh, thanks for watching, thanks for joining. Uh, for the few that watch, that actually watch. Um, we're growing, we're having a good time. Time, my voice cracks, goodness gracious. Uh, leave a like, comment something. Uh, what should I comment, Tyler? Give me a contract, at Raw Nutrition. Um, you can comment that, or tell us what your favorite flavor of cereal, like what's your favorite cereal is. Yeah, what, what's your favorite cereal? Mine's the, mine's Reese's Puffs. I love me some Reese's Puffs. But yeah, leave a like, comment your favorite cereal, subscribe, because uh, this is fun. This is more so just for me documenting, documenting this prep. Uh, I'll see you guys next time. Yeah.